members of family who are in such grief, who are in pain, to see it in a mother's eyes as I held her, who lost her entire family. It's hard to fathom what they're going through. City and state leaders tonight pledging support for the victims of this deadly fire. My whole house was nothing but black. Sixth floor resident Nikia Gonzalez says there were a few minutes that she thought she was going to die. Her sixth floor apartment in 333 East 181st Street was filled with smoke when a fire started on the third floor of the 19 story Bronx building this morning. Once the fire department got there and they was able to get us out, they said, follow the stairs until you see light. She is one of the lucky ones. Dozens were taken out of the building with life-threatening injuries. Stretcher after stretcher, emergency workers performed CPR. This smoke extended the entire height of the building. Completely unusual. Members found victims on every floor in stairways and were taking them out in cardiac and respiratory arrest. As the death toll rises, the mayor is calling this one of the worst fires in recent New York City history. The impact of this fire is going to really bring a level of just pain and despair in our city. The numbers are horrific. Witnesses say smoke and fire quickly move through the building and desperate residents waved towels out of their windows and screamed for help. They were also bringing people down the ladder that was unconscious. You could tell, like, looked like the smoke got them.